Hi everyone, Stacy Burke here, and it's a Monday, so it's time for the grocery haul. For you, it's a Monday. For me, it's a Wednesday, and on Wednesday we wear pink. This looks white, but it's pink. It's like a pale pink. Um, it's just like jogging pants and whatever. Here in the ponytail, I should probably take the keys out off my bra so they don't make noise. This is where I, I hang my keys when I don't want it. You know, I don't carry purses. They're cumbersome. So everything is, has a kabinger on it. And if you're noticing something different about this video, um, this is the very first grocery haul, haul that I'm using with my new computer. It's a Chrome notebook. So I'm learning it's different than a laptop and different than a PC. So I'm learning a little things about it. I don't have editing software installed in it yet. I'm still looking around and playing with it. So this video might be completely raw, just brought up with no bumper music or um, anything. I don't even know how to do the thumbnail on it. I did take a picture, I think. Um, and so, and I, I don't know. We'll just, we'll just figure it out together. I did do a couple videos with this um, before, but this is the first grocery haul uh, that I'm doing. So let me know what you think. I do notice that it captures more of my kitchen. It, my kitchen looks bigger with this. It's interesting. Um, but anyway, just let you know in case you know see the different of the sound quality and the picture and there's no bumper music there's no dee 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 you know it's not like any no credits nothing this raw just gonna put it right up but i think i spent a lot today i i always you know i try to do under a hundred dollars last week was kind of high was 90 something dollars today i think it's 80 something dollars uh so hopefully next week we'll be back to fifty dollars and stuff like that i think i'm just stocking up on fluids um like i'm really into sparkling water and and like uh, my ginger beer and and now i'm back into the ruby red grapefruit juice and so that that's kind of taken up stuff and i'm not working i'm only here so usually when i'm out and about working if i'm thirsty i'll just grab to the corner store, grab a water, and stuff like that, so I don't really stock up at home as much, but since I'm home, you know, anyway, let me show you what I got, I'll just get the boring stuff over first, $8.99, nine bucks for some more cat litter, because I need some more cat litter for my babies, so I got more cat litter, um, I thought I had some Hawaiian rolls, here because I haven't made my sloppy joes yet my vegan sloppy joes but it's in the freezer ready to go to make and I got the man which I got all the ingredients and I thought I had Hawaiian rolls but I don't I bought hot dog buns which are fine because I've been eating uh, hot dogs uh, vegan hot dogs so I wanted some but the store was completely sold out all they had was the small pack which is fine because that's probably all I need you know you know I don't need a bunch of it but they didn't have the regular Hawaiian rolls so I'm hoping they still have the Hawaiian bread taste. I'm hoping. These are savory butter rolls, but they're Hawaiian King brand. So I'm really hoping it has that Hawaiian uh, flavor, that sweet flavor, because that's gonna go so well in my vegan sloppy joes. So I got that. So that's first and foremost. And then I got another cucumber because I sometimes I make cucumber sandwiches or I put cucumbers in my wraps. Now it's like very refreshing, and I do like to drink coconut water now. I mean not coconut water, sorry, cucumber water. Um, I bought some stuff from I think I showed you last time drops from Amazon. What's well, so funny because my town since it's a beach town, you can tell it's a drinker town because the juices they have five calorie juice. I almost got it, but. It takes up too much room and I got the drops. I don't need it. But it's cucumber and lime juice. Five calories. All it is is cucumber and lime. And I go, oh my God, that looks so refreshing, so good. And that'll be such a great mixture. I bet they use it for mixtures. Because I've never seen that in the stores ever. So I was this close to getting it, but I already got it. That's my thing. I, You know me, me and my water. I don't like water so much. So I got to trick myself into certain things. So I really recommend like a cucumber, lime, um, you know, and I like sparkling water, so just that I would tell you. So I got some more cucumber, 
because I'm really into, I like vegetables. I'm not much into fruit, but I like vegetables. Okay, this is an impulse buy, because you know it's all about the condiments for me. I love condiments. Like, most of my stuff in my pantries and the refrigerator are condiments, because whenever, even if I eat out or whatever food, I like to doctor it up and stuff. In fact, I should have got some teriyaki sauce. I saw that. But I don't go to Chick-fil-A, because first of all, I don't eat chicken. I don't eat meat. Then second of all, some of their values I'm not really fond of. Um... But I don't know what this is. It's Polynesian sauce. Polynesian sauce. So if any of you guys go to Chick-fil-A, you probably know what this is. I'm assuming it's like a red sauce. I couldn't read the back of it because it's too tiny, even with my bifocals. So my bifocal sunglasses. Because um, I got the bifocal sunglasses. They're great. But because they're sunglasses, they, they just lack like no oh I got this on but I don't want to open it yet to try it it's still kind of little sugar soybean oil like it really doesn't tell me much like flavors like vinegar tomato paste paprika mustard okay uh, beet juice it sounds like it's gonna be it's a lot of calories 140 calories per serving usually sauces are like 30 calories, you know, like mustard and something. Usually it's like 30, 40 calories. 140 for two tablespoons. That's kind of a lot. Um, but I'm assuming it's almost like a sweet and sour. I don't know. It's interesting. I have uh, vegan chicken nuggets that I might try it with, or I don't know what I'll try it with. I gotta, I, someday I've got to open it up and just try it. So, Polynesian chicken play sauce, they, they have that. So I'm like, okay, I'll try it. Okay, there's my receipt. How much did I spend? Yeah, eighty-seven twenty-eight. Next week, uh-uh. Of course, there's a lot of things they didn't have. I wanted to get more creamer. They didn't have any creamer that I like. They, they so uh, you know. But like I said, I still have some. I'm, I'm good. I only got four bottles of champagne. I know one of these days I just got to break down and get the six bottles because. It's $5.99 a bottle if you get six bottles, and it's $6.99 if you don't. So even though I would have spent more, I would have saved money. So one of these things I do, but I am back on the champagne kick. So I got the Brut, which I like, and I got more of this, the Ruby Red No Sugar Added. I like this a lot. I need to go. I need to stay with this because orange juice, pineapple juice, the guava, like all that, even the tang, like uh, uh, this is the best. And I need to stock up on this. So I got some more of this because I just, I like it. No sugar, 100% juice, and it's ruby red, and I love it. Love it, love it, love it. As you could tell. Okay, so I got that. Okay, I wanted a big bottle of seltzer because it's only like 99 cents, right? But they only had flavors. So I finally like, okay, I'm just going to like break down and get the flavor one. This is the lime. So, I want a non-flavor because I don't know what I'm going to use it for. I might use it for a mixture of a drink. I might drink it like normal. I, I don't know what I'm going to use it for. So, I don't like to have the flavor of it, but I went ahead and just got it because it just makes more sense because I could have got a dollar for like a small one. So, I'm like, you know what? If I feel like lime, this is going to be it. So, I got the seltzer water and it's, it's lime flavored. So, I got that. More water, more water, more water. <laughs> Since I'm so hydrated, might as well dehydrate. This was on sale for $19.99. Now, last time I got the Evan, Evan Williams for um, $18.99, and I thought that was a better deal. But I put them side by side because last week these, these, this was out anyway. Oh, my God, this is so much bigger than the other one, and it's a dollar more. So I'm like, okay, they had Jim Beam, so I'm going to get it because... Um, if it that's why it's probably out because it's a better deal so I'm pretty much stocked up on whiskey <laughs> at least I hope so so and I like Jim Beam better of course I don't really know I I think I like Jim Beam better one of these days I want to do a, a, a whiskey taste test because my roommate loves Jameson he keeps it in the freezer I don't think I've ever tasted Jameson like some people do picklebacks I have a big jug of pickle juice like I don't know I do would like to try because I don't think Jameson and Coke people don't do Jameson and Coke or Jameson with ginger beer right Jameson is mainly 
a, a, a straight drink. That's something you drink a shot of, right? That's something maybe you make an Irish whiskey with or you have a pickleback. So, um, but I would like to try the difference if there's a difference. By the way, I did break a nail and I haven't been to the nail salon. I've been saving so much money. Um, I do the glue-ons now and they last a long time. And usually when it breaks off, I find it. So I'm hoping I find it when I was putting the, the, the groceries away so I could re-glue it on. Um, I usually file it and glue it on. So um, I do my own nails now. I love it. Love it. Okay. I have an onion in there, but it's starting to, you could tell, yeah. Plus I've been using it, so it's, I'm getting, I have like very little left. Plus it's getting kind of, you know how they get a little slimy, like you gotta cut around it. So I got another red onion because I put it in everything. Everything, everything, everything. And I don't even buy lettuce anymore. I just buy spinach. I'm a, I'm, I, I use spinach as like lettuce. I put it in my, my sandwiches, my everything. Um, I just made some Spanish rice with beans. And I put a, like a lemon and some Tabasco in it. And I sometimes I spoon a little salsa in it. And I make a mixture of it. And then I, I heat up some spinach to go with it. And I put it in a tortilla. And I put it in a wrap. And it's so good. So, so, so good. Okay, so might as well get this out. And they have the ginger beer, ladies and gentlemen. This whole thing is like $2.99, three bucks. So it's worth it. You get a 12 pack for three bucks of ginger beer. And if you know, ginger beer is kind of expensive um, if you buy the individual. So they treat it like a soft drink at Vons, which I love it. And it's the same price if we got Coca Cola. And like I said, it's, it's full on sugar. So that's why I use the sparkling water. Like I kind of mix a half and half of ginger beer and the water um, because sometimes it's just too much sugar and I don't want that much sugar. And sometimes it's not as refreshing. So that's why all the sparkling water because I do mix the ginger beer with my sparkling water. And ginger beer is not alcoholic. It's just what they call it. It's, it's ginger ale is a lighter thing. Ginger beer has more of a ginger flavor to it. It has more like a bite to it. It's a little more bitter. I like it. I like it. So there's my ginger beer. <sighs> then of course I got more water. Yeah, you know, it's been hot, so I've been like drinking it. So I got like, a, I got a little bit of a half a liter or a liter, whatever, whatever this, half a bottle left of the last one. So I always stock up, so I have extra water. So yes, I do drink regular steel water as well. And they don't need it quite yet, but I went ahead and grabbed it just in case because it is starting to get a little funky. So I got more broccoli slaw for my birdies, and I use it as well. If I do make the sloppy joes, I might throw some of that in there, make my own uh, broccoli slaw, and put that on the side. And this was impulse buy. I probably didn't need it, but this was only five bucks. Avocados are very expensive. Like they're like a dollar an avocado, but they were on sale for two two for four dollars I almost got one like for two dollars but then I thought well this bundles five dollars and I think they did the bundle because they're not quite ripe yet and they are smaller but they will be ripe eventually so I'm like okay and like I have frozen guacamole in the freezer but sometimes you don't want the guacamole sometimes you just want the pure avocado on a sandwich or something uh, which is salt and pepper or on toast or whatever so I broke down and got, got it. So that is my 87 or $88, ladies and gentlemen. That is my grocery haul. A little more than I, I plan to. Um, like I said, hopefully next week I I don't hope, won't need so much. But then, I don't know, I'm going to need more water. I'm going to need, you know, probably the cat litter again. And that's a big, you know, that's like nine bucks. and So it adds up. And the, the, that Chick-fil-A... A Polynesian sauce I think was like five bucks it wasn't even on sale but it was just so interesting like I just like and when I was people like when I have when I'm like mm, I wonder how that is like I like condiments so all right I'm gonna put everything away and try to figure out this new computer on how to upload it and maybe I'll try it I don't think I could edit but I think I took a picture so hopefully that'll be the thumbnail so We'll see. It's HD. Finally, everyone's been wanting HD. Get a new computer. Okay, I did. But it's not really a computer. It's like, it's a notebook. 
a chrome notebook, whatever that means. So it's a little different. But all right, I'll let you go because I really don't even know how much how to tell how much battery I have left. I'm still learning all the little buttons. Like everything's in different places. Like even copy and paste. I'm so used to um, right clicking and left clicking for copy and paste, and this doesn't allow it. I have to scroll up to the top and hit copy, and then scroll up to the top and click paste. So I'm like, that's interesting. I'm sure there's a way to do it on the keyboard, but it's not the way I'm used to. So I'm still learning. All right, to all my Sace Cadets and all my Briquettes, I hope you have a groovy day. Until next time, peace. Like, look, I gotta find where the button is. Hey.